All right, so this is a suggestion via donation. The name of this song is uh, Reagan uh, by the artist Killer Mike. Listen, if you guys are new here, please like and subscribe. The more that you like this content, the more that I know that you specifically would like to see more of this specific type of content, okay? Well, let's go and just jump into this immediately. Let's go and check this out, guys. Also, lyrics are pulled up just in case we need them, all right? government has a firm policy not to capitulate to terrorist demands, that no concessions policy remains in force. In spite of the wildly speculative and false stories about arms for hostages and alleged ransom payments, we did not, repeat, did not trade weapons or anything else for hostages, nor will we. The valid All right, we're doing this. We're doing this. Okay, Reagan, Ronald Reagan. All right. Um, let's 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 just get into it, guys. Immediately. Listen. So the um the overall animation style of the video itself is great. Um, I love the way it feels. Love the way it feels. All right. Um, the beat definitely feels super ominous, guys. And alleged ransom payments. We did not repeat. Did not trade weapons or anything else. Hostages. Is that right? The ballot of the bullets. Freedom of some bullshit. Will we ever do it bigger? Just keep settling for little shit. We brag on having bread, but none of us are bakers. Ooh. We all talk having greens, but none of us on acres. If none of us on acres and none of us grow wheat, then who will feed our people when our people need to eat? You're right. Literally. If you're saying what you, I mean. We're here. We're here. Let's get it. Let's get it. I'm gonna try not to stop so much, guys. But when our people need to eat, so it seems our people starve from lack of understanding. Cause all we seem to give them starve. is starve and some dancing. As we're talking about our car and imaginary mansions, we should be indicted for bullshit we incited. Ooh. We have the children deaf and pretend that it's exciting. We are advertisements for agony and pain. We exploit the youth. We tell them to join the gang. We tell them dope stories, introduce them to the gang. Just like I love a North introduced us to cocaine in the 80s. When them bricks came on military plane. Guys, this is an entire conversation. Uh, this isn't like breaking bars down, bro. He, there's some bars, a lot of bars, bro. I, I love the way this is flowing. Listen, we don't have bread because none of us are bakers, bread bakers, right? Um, we're talking greens, right? But none of us own acres. Right? The, the the whole the whole rhyme scheme of this is absolutely phenomenal, guys. Um this is a full conversation. That's what this is. This is a full conversation that we're not going to have right now, guys. Um, because uh, the goal is to actually, um, pretty soon we should be launching a, another channel, right? And the other channel is going to be purely about just conversations about things like this kind of, for the most part, and other worldly topics. Um, that's where this is probably going to go, right? Um, so we're just going to go ahead and listen to this here, and um, we're going to probably revisit this song on the, on the other channel. Absolutely, this belongs there, guys. Wow. Let's get it, guys. Two months ago, I told the American people I did not trade arms for hostages. My heart and my best intentions still tell me that's true, but the facts... But it's not. ...and the evidence tell me it is not. The end of the Reagan era. I'm like Lemma 12 Old enough to understand the shit that changed forever. They declared the war on drugs, like a war on terror. But what it really did was let the police terrorize whoever. But mostly black boys, but they would call us niggas. And lay us on our belly while they fingers on their triggers. They boots was on our head, they dogs was on our crotches. And they would beat us up if we had diamonds on our watch. And they would take our drugs and monies as they pick our pockets. I guess that that's the privilege of policing for some profits. But thanks to Reaganomics, prison turned to profits. Cause free labor's the cornerstone of U.S. economics. Cause slavery was abolished unless you are in prison. You think I ambush it and then read the 13th Amendment? Yeah, guys, definitely. Read the 13th Amendment. You'll be like, wait a second, huh? What happened? What? Read it. 
Like in terms of like, did, did someone come and speak to him after this song, guys? Because like, mm, you start talking about, all right, the international banks situation that was happening with you know Reagan and Obama, and specifically the guy you know in Libya. I'm not gonna say his name. You get what I'm saying here? <laughs> um, this is deep, guys. This is absolutely deep. I wonder, like this, it, it honestly makes me wonder if. Someone came to come speak. They had. Uh, did they speak to him about this? I wonder. Seriously. Fuck is that? Staring in my window, doing that surveillance on Mr. Michael Render. I'm dropping off the grid before they pump the lid. I leave you with four words. I'm glad Reagan did. Wow. All right. Oh, that's why they kept saying six, six, and six. That's why they kept doing that. Because Ronald Wilson Reagan. We're here. Wilson Reagan. <clears throat> Guys, there's so much. There's there's so much to be had here in this uh, this specific song. Uh, I think the production itself sounds amazing. Absolutely. Um, now, how he rapped over the entirety of it was also great. Um, his rhyme schemes, internal rhythms, external rhythm. Um, he seemed to have jumped the bar line a couple of times. He he just. It's almost like he breathes this. If that makes any sense, he breathes hip hop, and that's nothing but respect. I love hip hop, so respect. Right now, the subject matter, Reagan. Um, all right, <laughs> guys. Uh, to my knowledge, I really wasn't really a fan of of his existence. I don't think I was even like uh, old enough to even know of his existence, to be honest. Right, but from growing up, you know, hear, hearing some of the things within the community of of you know about Reagan, um, he was not he was not liked at all. Right. Um, you know, certain certain pieces of our American population loved him, right? Absolutely, but for the most part, people that uh, you know look like me, right, or or similar to me, let's say, right, um, they absolutely hated him, everything about him, um, and there was a lot of things that were done in the eighties that that kind of made it so that was going to be a guarantee, right? Um, but yeah, listen. Let me know in the comments on the next thing from him I should be listening to, and I will get into that as soon as I possibly can, all right? And listen, you guys all have an amazing day, and enjoy it thoroughly, all right?